Hello guys, so welcome to KO Tutorials. So let's continue with the next part of this tutorial, a car modeling tutorial. So let's get started. So as you can see over here, we have started with the modeling of this car over here. So let's continue it. So very first of all, again, I'll switch back the subdivisions to zero. Let's again go back to the side over here. So very first of all, what I'll be doing over here is like, if you clearly look at it, I'll go into the edit mode over here and definitely I'll just select this and go to the side over here and I'll slightly just push it up over here. Same way, I'll select this, I'll slightly just push it up, I'll select this, I'll slightly push this up. So once you go on pushing it up over here, you will definitely see that uh, we have to manage this part over here accordingly. So let's again go over here. If you want, we can select this over here and slightly push this up or else only this part and this part we can shift this up this can be pushed up a bit so what we are doing over here is like we are adjusting it accordingly let's go to the top view over here let's go to the top view over here so now let's again go into this edges over here let's go into its edges press E and slightly extrude it let's go into this view over here so before we extrude this part a uh, very important thing is like let's select the vertices and let's adjust it let's adjust it in this way let's let's adjust it accordingly so go on adjusting it accordingly in this way So slightly just push this up over here and again go back over here select the edges and slightly just extrude it over here select the vertices and adjust it. much better after that after you are done with this if you want to see how it looks like after you have smoothened it we can go into this side again if you want to create the doors individually, you can go with that. But I'll select this whole thing. I'll slightly extrude it. Let's go to the top again over here. Select the vertices. Select this. slightly just push it inside okay. 
so go to side again again select this edges and extrude it over here select the vertices in this way slightly push this up save your file and now let's use one loop over here by pressing ctrl r again let's select this edge extrude it put a loop over here select this edge go on extruding it and slightly rotate it so keep on doing that so again rotate it again extrude and rotate it so go on doing that Alright, so let's go on adjusting it accordingly. So let's use Ctrl R over here. So we can slightly adjust that stuff. Go to the side again, select the edges, go on extruding it. So make sure not putting too many loops also. So again select the vertices. That's it. Select the edges over here. We can slightly put one loop over here again select this shift select this drag it over here so what I can do over here is like I can slightly shift this a bit a bit inside slightly so select the vertices right click merge vertices at center right click merge vertices at center over here so again select this edge over here slightly extrude that select this merge vertices at center over here after that what I'll be doing is like I can merge this at center select this press E and extrude it over here merge vertices right click we can merge it I think uh, only one is selected so make sure you are selecting both the vertices then only it's going to show you the merge vertices option so what I can do over here is like I will be slightly pushing this up I will be slightly making this changes now 
adjust this perfectly all right so definitely we'll be merging those uh, elements wherever it is required over here so press control r over here so you can go into this and you can see the difference over here we are definitely working on it you can see so you can go into the object mode you can definitely see the difference over here so guys if you have any doubts please write it in the comment section over here so we have to match the references and definitely will be finalizing the output so a lot of things left over here to be modeled up over here so please like and subscribe my youtube channel so we'll continue the rest of the part in the next tutorial so thanks for watching this tutorial